Woohoo! Hello, dear friends. It's Chris here. How are you? I hope everything's well. So I have unboxing for you. So this is part one of two from my dear friends from DIY Choose. Um, so before we start, let's get the other stuff taken care of. First, Facebook group, me and Angie. Great place. Answer the questions to be approved. Number two, my Instagram below as well. All this stuff will be linked below. Number three, I am currently in January doing a Klimt community diamond paint along. So if you have one, please join us um, and use the hashtag DPKlimt 2022 to see the progress. It's just a funsies um, event to uh, enjoy diamond painting together. Okay, so now, Back to the item at hand is DIY Choose Diamond Paintings. Yes, I have two videos for you. Today I'll have three items and the next part will have four. So I'm going to show you my special shaped mandalas in this video. I have, like I said, there's three of them. The first one is, well, they're all 30 by 40. Excuse me, scratch that, they're 30 by 30s. And this one has 13 shapes, colors, and sizes. So this is really pretty. It has a black um, partial colored background. So the background is not diamond painted. And here we have it. So first, again, Legends of the Fall right here. And this is the painting. Very pretty. The black background will really make it pop with all these colors. And I, again, I like this one because you get the rhinestones and then you get the different color or, and shape. No, you get the different size rounds. So you have the regular size and larger ones. And I really think, you know, that's gonna contrast and look really great because here is the thumbnail. The drill field, again, super clear. The only part that's sticky is the area where you diamond paint on. Now, let's take a look at our diamonds, our gems. So you get a sense of what it will look like. First, a very beautiful light yellow. And we get the royal blue, a denim blue. We get a couple greens. They are two different color greens. Um, almost impossible to tell the difference between these two. We get a red, orange. We even have some white. Let's see, number eight. Where does that white go out of curiosity? The up, all right. Now we get to the larger ones. We get some beautiful yellow large ones, red. These are both faceted, by the way. Then these large blue ones are not faceted. They're smooth round ones. You get some medium sized white ones and you get some larger half pearls. in case any of you want interested. <laughs> so when I store them, this is how I store them because I set, do them separately and it helps it a little bit. Um, so I know the size, I know what general type painting it is. I put partial special shape for this one and I put called this flowers and circles. This is kind of looks like a flower with a bunch of circles. It'll give me a general sense of what's here. Um, Sometimes there are a lot, some are easier than the others to name them. Okay, so our next one, same size, 30 by 30, but this one has 18 shapes, colors, and sizes. And I really like this one because it has a lot of larger gems. So here is our Legends of the Fall. As you can see, very diverse 
types and as you can see here as well. So here the background is drilled. Look at all of that. So, so you drive and paint all this. Then you have marquees here. You have large teardrops, large teardrop, teardrops, marquees, smaller ones. I mean, so this is a really good amount of rhinestones to special shape uh, comparison. I really like these kinds because again, I love the huge gems. So let's see what we have here. This one, there are some in baggies and there are some with the train packaging. So in our train, we have our rhinestones, mostly. So here we have a very pretty, uh, this is an orangey red, teal, a brown color. Surprising, what is that, number six? Okay, that, that's on the out, outer edge of the, we have clear, we have yellow, this is a black. This will be the background, a black resiny type with the silver back. And here we have teeny little slivers that they're like, they're like textured, not textured, but they have um, cuts in them, you know, on the sides. It's not just a regular type sliver. Let's see, I don't know if you could tell but they're like a teal color. Very pretty. So those are part one, and here are our other ones. So we have some iridescent teardrops. Some beautiful. Look at those, I love these marquees. You could see the cuts. You could see the different colors running through them. Again, small teardrops. You could see the colors going through them. How can you not love this mandala? This is gonna be beautiful. Shards even we have in here. These are faceted emerald colors. Purple. And our two large gems, we have these large emerald teardrops and faceted, look at how beautiful they are. And sapphire, royal blue, cobalt, whatever you wanna call them, they're just gorgeous. So this is a, if you love mandalas and you love special shapes, this is a must. It will turn out fantastic. Again, Look at that. And our last one. Again, it's 30 by 30. It's 15 colors, shapes, and sizes. And it's very colorful. It looks like from here, probably mostly rhinestone. But we have do have special shapes as well. Again, our legend. Tons of color and tons of... of coverage in this mint the last two this this one is basically a full crystal if you want to call it full crystal I mean it, it's technically these are technically partials full crystal who knows but there's no partial area everything gets painted somewhere in here and everything except the tiniest little areas in the black on this one get diamond painted 
and I don't know this, I don't have the information here, but judging perhaps by this, this could be maybe a luminous one. I don't know. I probably not. Sometimes you could tell with the color that they print on the sim on the, the symbols and all that. So we have our clear, some greens. This is a very pretty greenish blue, sea foamy kind, bright blue, tealish, baby pink, red, purple, and yellow. Those are our rhinestones. And for our specials, we have large cap pearls. We have these little orange teardrops. And our beautiful blue ones, faceted. Large rhinestones. These are faceted yellow rounds large teal rhinestone and a smooth yep smooth red there goes my doorbell so but i think it's just a he's dropping off but just in case hold on okay i'm back <laughs> like i said in another video only when i'm filming does anybody interrupt me every other time I'm here, nothing's happening, not a peep. As soon as I hit record, phones ring, doorbells ring, Skype rings, <laughs> something goes on. So, anyways, I'm done for this part one. I showed you all three items and the diamonds, so let's just do a quick recap. We have the last one, as I said, the colorful mandala. Is this even considered a mandala? I think it is. I'm calling it that. I think it is listed as that too, if I'm not mistaken. This is probably my favorite because of all the large gems. It's going to look spectacular. And this one, which is a true partial, lots of background, not done. However, I'm a good enough majority. Okay, guys, thank you so much for joining me today. Um, please comment, please like, subscribe, share, all that stuff. And um, thank you so much to DIY Choose. Uh, I truly appreciate our little friendship and relationship going on. And um, I, just as much as I really appreciate all of you out there for your love, support, kindness, kind words, friendship, all that good stuff. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. I got disrupted. So now my brain has gone. <laughs> so until next time, let me just say, be safe, be happy, stay safe, stay happy. Everything will be linked below. Have a great day. Thank you, DIY Choose. Thank you, dear friends. Until next time, bye.